Please be aware the course this number may be recorded and or monitored for whatever purposes we deem necessary. Good afternoon. Hello. 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 Hi, sir. Hi, sir. This, this is Brian. I was just speaking to you. Oh, hello there, Brian. It's a pleasure you called me back. I, I know what happened. The line must have died. I had someone call me back. One minute. That's, I'm, that's going to, fine I'm, going, I'm going to transfer you to the bat phone. Give me one second. One second there, sir. In transfer. Uh, to whom you are transferring me? Hello, Brian. Can you hear me? Yes, sir, I can hear you. Yes, yeah, sorry, sorry about that. I I took the call uh, while I was on the lavatory, but I'm I'm finished on the lavatory now, so I've transferred it through to here. Okay, uh, Scott, if you don't mind, can you just hold on? I'll just uh, I I just need to do a bit of work. If you can just hold on, it, I'll just uh, come back on the line. Can, can, can I ask a few? Seconds. Can I ask a few questions about my computer? Just I yes, I you had, can ask me. I just had hold, to call. Just hold I had, on. Uh, okay, sir. Just hold on, I'll do that. Hold on. Okay, darling. Hello? Yeah, so, so you're on your... On your, you're, you're very quiet. Do you have the phone upside down, perhaps? Just a second. Yeah, so uh, now you're on your uh, system? Yes, Please. yes. Okay, so uh, what issue uh, the guy who called you up, he has told you? What okay. he was telling about it. What, what he's done is, he, he's told me that I need to fix it, and if it's not fixed, if I don't let him fix it, my internet provider will be closing me down, and the government will be coming to have words with me. So I'm, I'm just, just very... No, 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 this is totally rubbish. No, see, if you are having a problem in your system, if you, uh, your system is not, uh, you know, you have some various files or some, you know, unwanted files on your system. So it's nothing to do with your uh, internet provider and it's nothing to do with the government. Why the government will come and speak to you for your system if you have any issues with it? See, everyone have issues in the system. Government won't, won't go to at everyone's home and speak to them. But, but he said it, just logically, he, you can think. He told yeah, me I'm, they are I'm just saying rubbish. I'll fix it for you right now. Can you see, uh, you are sitting on your front of your computer? I'm, no, I'm not at the moment. No, not at the moment. Um, I'm, I'm quite worried about even switching it on. I mean, he says it'll break the internet if I use it. No, no, no. See, uh, so he's still fixing your computer. I'm, I'm, I'm not in front of it at the moment. No, the computer is um, the computer is downstairs. It's in the basement. Okay, I'll do one thing, sir. Uh, you yes. don't need to worry. Uh, I, I'll do one thing. For you, I have one of my colleagues who is the best technician sitting in our office. And yes. I'll ask him to call you. He will fix everything for you, okay? And he will not charge you even a single penny for that, okay? But That's remember wonderful. that you don't need to fix it from anyone else. You don't need to pay anything to anyone else for this, okay? Okay, that sounds good, Brian. Okay. And, and sir, as I was saying to you that you are getting your money back, okay, the forty nine yes. pounds and the three hundred and eighty nine pounds. Yes. So both the checks you will be getting it next week, most probably, okay. And okay. Uh, as you are getting your money back for that also, you do not need to pay even a single penny to us, okay. There's no handling shipping charges, no fees, is nothing at all. You need to pay, okay. Okay. That's your personal money, so you don't know. You don't need to pay even a single penny, okay. Okay, that's good. So do you have any questions regarding the money which you're getting made? I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm quite startled, Brian. I'm, I'm so used to people calling me and they ask me for money and they ask me for bank details uh, and, and all no this. No worries, right now you don't need to worry because all you need to do is that you just need to wait in your home till next week. You will get the checks on your name. You can take the checks to your bank, deposit them in your account. And the checks will take a maximum of two or three days to get the money credit in your account. When you see that, yes, you got the money in your account, at that point of time, you can believe me. Because you're not paying me anything, you're not giving any bank information. So for you, you're always on the safer side. You don't need to worry about anything, okay? Okay, Brian. That's good. Okay. Also, one more thing, sir. Uh, do, are you using, uh, do you have an email ID? I, I do, yes. Okay, what we will do is, as soon as I get the checks prepared at my end, I will just take a scan copy. I'll just do a scan copy of the checks, of both of the checks, and I will mail I will mail it to you. I'll send the checks cop, uh, copy of the scan. I'll send you the scan copy of the checks to you in the mail. Okay, okay. so that you can check it at your end that everything is written properly 
there's no kind of changes to be made, no, you know, mistakes. If you want anything to be changed, you can revert us back on the mail. We will change it and resend it to you. Okay. okay. That's good. Okay. So, I'll, can I have your email ID on which I could send you the scanned copy of the check, mate? Yes, it is Commander. Commander. At. At. Time Rider. That's Tango India Mike Echo Romeo. Oh, yeah, Time Rider. Yes. You mean that? Yes, Time oh, I Rider. I do have that same. I do have that same name in my email. That's you do. Great. Yes, it's time rider. Yeah. Yes. And um, after that, it's after that. It's a dot code UK. That's right. Yes. Okay. And one more thing, sir. You know, uh, as you were getting your money back and a compensation from the company, along with this, sir, I personally need a favor. I need help from you, if you don't mind. Right. Well, do not worry, sir. I don't want any money, fees, or any financial help from you. No. I don't want that. Even I do not want to sell anything to you. Right. At the moment, sir, I'm working with two different companies. The first one is the same from where you're getting the money back and a compensation. Yes. And, uh, and along with that, sir, I'm personally part-time working as a promoter over here. Okay? Yes. Like, basically, what is my work? I do promotions for different companies. I tell the customer who this company is, where they're based, what they do, and all. And uh, for doing this, for doing this survey, uh, this company gives me a commission of a 10, 12 pound, okay? Oh, great. Wonderful, yes. Okay. So, uh, if you can, uh, you know, at the moment, sir, I'm doing a promotion for a PPI company, for a payment protection insurance company. I'm right. not really, I'm not giving any, I'm not giving you any PPI, I'm not bothering you to claim a PPI, no, because that's not my job. As I said to you, I just give a free and a no obligation survey only. So, uh, you know, uh, Steve, you can, if you can only and only help me out by listening a survey over the phone, to be very honest with you, you will just get some idea that who the people are, and personally I'll get some commission of 10 12 pounds from them. Right, right, we, we should get some loans from that, that should be good. Yeah, and moreover, Steve, the survey which I'm asking you to listen, for you, it is absolutely free and no obligation. That means it's free of cost, you're not obliged to take, to do, or to change anything, no. Also, right. it will not take any of your 20, 30 minutes over the phone, no. It will only take a four minutes, maximum four and a half minutes over the phone, done. That's it. Okay. So, uh, Steve, can you please listen to a survey for me for the people? That would be a very, 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 very good favor, sir. I'll never, ever forget this in my whole life. Please. Oh, uh, you've been very helpful there, Brian. Yes, let, let's go on get some laws. You carry on with your survey and get your 12 pounds. That's wonderful. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much, sir. Trust me, that would be a really great favor. So, Steve, in order to listen to the survey for the PPEC, can you first of all tell me, do you, uh, ha did you had ever any kind of loan in last 10 years uh, which you have might paid off or you might be still paying? Any yes. loan, credit card, mortgage, Yes, we, we have the loan and the credit cards and the mortgage. Yes, you did have, okay. And from which bank you had that loan? That's with the toy bank. It's Tango Oscar, Tango, sorry. <coughs> Tango Oscar Yankee Bravo Alpha the Kilo. It's all one word. Uh, sorry, which bank? Sorry? Oh, sorry, uh, I couldn't get that. What was the bank name? It's, it's Toy Bank Incorporated. It's uh, there. No, oh, Toy Bank do. Incorporated. Okay. Apart of yes. that, did you have a loan from any other bank? Uh, I think we got one once from the, the TSB. We got one from the TSB once upon a time. TSB. Okay. TSB. No problem. See, uh, you know, uh, Steve, as you know, yes. you are helping me to listen a survey, and you are listening the survey for me. I don't want you to share your personal details over the phone for the survey because I even don't want people ringing you every now and then. So just to uh, make your de de details safe and secure, what I'll do is I'll give you some information from my end. I'll give you my details on behalf of which you can only and only listen to the survey. Right. Okay. Okay. So can you just grab a pen and paper in your handy? No. Oh, hang on a moment. I have to find a pen. Will I need one? Just one second. I'll get a pen and paper. Sure. Sure. 
Okay, sir, go ahead. Hello. Hello. Okay, uh, sir, for, yeah, first of all, sir, hello, can you hear me? I can hear you, yes. Yeah, so first of all, sir, to listen to the survey, I will connect you to one of my survey people who, who are just beside me, and they will speak to you. They will see that, sir, we are calling from the PPI, we are helping you to get the PPI money back, etc., etc., and they will tell you that it's a free and a no-obligation survey they are calling you for that, okay? Right. Right. Okay, so the first thing that they will ask you is that, sir, can you tell me how much was the loan on which you think you paid the PPI? Uh, Forty-one thousand so, pounds. Yeah, so you can write it down. Uh, you don't need to tell your exact details because uh, you are just listening a survey for me. So you don't need oh, to tell uh, your details, okay? Okay, yes. So write it down. When they ask you how much was the loan, please write it down. Tell them the loan was for only ten thousand. Right. Tell them yeah, only and ten thousand. Ten thousand, okay. and they'll ask you from which bank you had it. Simply yes. tell them you had it from Lloyd's TSB. Lloyd's TSB, yes. Okay. And uh, just to hold on. Yes. Yeah, and after that, sir, they will ask you in which year you took the loan out. So tell them you took the loan out in the year two thousand and five. Yes. And you finished the loan in 2013. I started it when? You started it in 2005, in 2005. Okay, yes, I've got that. And you and you finished, you managed to finish the loan in 2013. Okay, yes. Okay, that's fine. What one the other information? Do I need to give them a name? Is there a special name or? No, 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 no. I'll tell you. Once you will tell them that you know, sir, you have uh, finished the loan in 2013. After that, they will ask you that, uh, Mr. Scott, do you know that you have paid the PPI on the loan, or do you know PPI was missold to you? Tell them yes. I know PPI was paid or PPI was missold because oh, yes. I remember. Yeah, tell them I remember uh, when I was taking the loan. The large TSB people told me that this is something which is compulsory, and I have to take it. I have to pay it. So that's why I paid them the PPI in the beginning. When I was taking the loan, they they okay. said it. W they didn't say that though. They said it was optional. They said I didn't have to. Yeah, I know that, but you were just listening a survey, so it doesn't make any difference. Oh, so just okay. tell them it's compulsory. Okay, I t they told me yeah, it's compulsory. That's okay. It. Yeah, that's it, sir. That's it. After that, they will not ask you any questions, no details, nothing. What they will do is, they will say that, uh, sir, we are sending some information to you in the post. Once you get those information, you can keep it with you. And in future, if you, your friends, colleagues, neighbor, anyone in your known is interested to, uh, you know, claim a PPI, Please, please forward our information to them, or if you are interested to claim, then you can get in touch with us. That's it, and the call will be ended, okay? All right. Yeah, and uh, so do not worry, when you receive the papers, don't worry, no one will call you back, because when you will receive the papers, I will tell them that you're not interested, I spoke to you twice, and you don't want, it to, you don't want to claim, so no one will even call you back. Okay. Okay, okay. And, uh, and just, uh, it's just a big request from my end. Please do not tell the, you know, PPI people that I requested you to listen to the survey or I gave you these details. Otherwise, they will positively kick me out of the company and I'm too young for the pension as well, okay? <laughs> oh, so please right. don't tell them. Right. Also, sir, the money, uh, you know, which you're getting, that's your personal money. It is no connection with the PPI. So please do not speak to the PPI people regarding the money and all which you're getting because they really do not have any clue that from where you're getting, why you're getting. They are totally different from the, you know, money and all, okay? Right. Okay, so I'll do one thing before I connect you with the PPI survey people. I will confirm myself the details from you, so there will be no mistake when you speak to them. So what you will tell them? How much was the loan? Oh, ten thousand. And from which bank you will tell them? Um, I'll say that uh, it's Lloyd's TSB. Yes, and if they ask you uh, when you took the loan and when you finished off? Oh, hang on, I'll just check on the list. Oh, Two thousand and five. Uh -huh. Yes. And when you finish the loan? One moment. I have what you've written down here. 2013. Yeah. And uh, do you know you paid the PPI? What you will tell them? Y yes, I, I know I paid it because I remember when I took out the loan 
and they says it's compulsory that I have to get it. Fantastic, sir. Only this you need to tell them. And, sir, uh, can I have your date of birth if you don't mind? Don't you already have it? Oh, just a second, let me check it. I think if I have it, I'll just check it out. No, I don't have it. Can I have it? Okay, it's the first of the fourth. Uh huh. 1913. Uh huh. So when you were born in 1913? Yes, yes. I'm 101 now. Oh, fantastic. You're 101 now. I'm 101, that, that Brian. And I'm that, still that's going. Really, that's really cool. I mean, you know, uh, I'm, I'm just speaking to the first man. I, I feel myself very lucky speaking to someone who is... 101 years old. Do you That's know what? Really, I mean, do you know what the secret is, Brian? Yeah, please tell me the secret. Even I want to grow around 101. You I want to, to be. You have to eat bananas, cookies. I have to eat bananas, cookies, and, and cookies, yeah. chocolate cookies, and you need to have lots of women. As many women as possible. At least a new one every week. <laughs> That'll keep you going, Brian. Okay, <laughs> I got it. I got it. Now I can. I know I can see from where you're coming through. <laughs> so that's the main reason, right? Yes. So that is why you. That's that's really. But you know, only few people have those that much talent. See, in my whole life, I have seen only two people who are that much talented. First is you. Second is one of my boss. He's also very much talented in that part. So uh, I, I'll try if I can be like this. But, does, uh, does, your boss, I mean. does your boss eat bananas and cookies and have a new woman every week? Uh, no, he eats bananas. And yes. uh, the third one, he he's also, uh, you know, perfect in the third one, the third, uh, you know, thing you told me. Yes. Like, every week he's very much, you know, and, but the second thing, he doesn't eat the cookies. So I'll ask him to eat cookies as well, so that he can grow 101. Uh, he can go through, the you know, eating the cookies helps helps with the ladies because it helps the erection. Oh yeah, seriously, yes. man, this is something I haven't I haven't got you know taught. I haven't been taught from anyone. No, re so really, you you um, eat, a, eat a packet of cookies before the lady, and it'll be very very solid. Yes, very solid. Okay, just one thing, uh, Mr. Scott. See, uh, as I'll connect you with my PPI people, so. Uh, they have a particular criteria in their survey. So if you don't mind, if they ask you what is your date of birth, so please tell them you were born in 1945 instead of 1913, okay? Okay, I'll do that. Okay, tell them you were born in 1945 and yes. from 45 at the moment you are 69 in age, okay? Okay. And this is Brian, yeah, Brian. Brian, yeah. I, I'm going to have to visit the lavatory, so if you can, can you call me back a little while? Sure, when do you want me to call you back? About, about 30 minutes. Sure, I'll call you after 30 minutes. That's no issue. Okay, thank you thank very you, much. Brian. Thank you, And thank bye you bye. for the advice. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye.